Hello. Welcome back. We are Operation Brown Town. I am Kyle the Scientist. I am Greer the Bystander. Yes. He's um I just happened to walk in and he was doing this and So um First recording session not didn't go too well. Yeah, we kind of um we blew it up. So we re rebuilt it. If there's anything that's like inconsistent with the previous video, it's because I had to rebuild this whole freaking thing. Well, no, I didn't have to. Re Actually, I didn't, because I built it freaking awesome. So it only blew up like three, three of the glass blocks and like two down at the bottom bar. So, um, yeah, Kyle Williams, always the boss. I mean, not my name. <laughs> Don't come to my house. All right. Um. So basically, what we got here is uh, we got our right. MFSU set up. All right, so I'm gonna teach you guys how to set up the nuclear reactor chamber so that it doesn't so it's blow safe up. safe and secure. Um, yeah, like our last it'll, it'll pretty much never explode. Um, I, I've never had problems with this uh, setup. So let's get a thermometer, just because we can. And then um, let's let's have the cells off to the side so I don't have to keep uh, spawning, coming out here to spawn them. All right, so as you can see, it's at zero hole heat because it's not on. Um, so, you want to keep it at zero volt heat, uh, most of the time, uh, unless you're insane. Alright, so you're going to need, I think it's 24, 24 coolant cells, we counted it out. Um, Isn't it like three rows and then minus two or something? Yeah, it's minus, minus three. Alright, so I think, uh, well, one extra. Alright. So you should have like three, three rows filled up with, uh, if minus, minus three, minus three of these, uh. And you should probably just place them down. Um, so... What you want to do is you want to have these surrounding uh, the the uranium cells on every side. Up, down, left, and right. Um, and then, yeah, if you if you're blind, um, and you you're for you some to play Minecraft, so you manage to get on YouTube in general. You manage to use a computer. All right. Um, <laughs> all right. So what else do we need? We need coolants, or we need uh, integrated heat dispersers, like no tomorrow. Um, so let's just get a whole bunch of those. Let's get a crap load. Just you just have to fill it to the brim. Fill every left, all the other slots that are left. Just fill them all. That is a setup. It is perfect. It is beautiful, and it will last for a, good time. a long time. I've never actually had to replace my unit. I've never had to replace any of this stuff because I only play. I only, I only keep it on for like 20 seconds at a time, trying to power a macerator. Yeah. Level one machine, the first thing you make. Oh, it's nighttime. Ah! Dust. No! No! I hate nighttime. It's so scary. Are we on, uh, we're on bright. We're good. Alright. So, um, now that you have that set up, uh, let's, let's pull the, let's pull the switch. Turn it on. You'll be able to hear it, uh, clicking. The radiation sound. So that means, every time it clicks, I think that's like a, I think that's like one... That's some that's e EU being released. Um, so now this is charging up. Look at that. Oh yeah, it's already powered. Look at that. Look at how much power that is. It's moving up like a thousand every uh, ten oh, seconds. Way to way to rain at the wrong time, man. Rain, rain, go away. Come again another day. Some, 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 some. All right. Um. Okay. So. Greer here has no idea what to do with this power because it's so much power, and he doesn't understand anything about power. this game. He no doesn't, man he doesn't understand anything in this game, to be honest. Arctic, and I just so power. I'm gonna build us something that will take all this power and use it for something. So we're gonna make ourselves a. Uh, this is gonna be a du double tutorial video because we're also gonna be making. What is it called? Force field, yeah! I know, no, I have, I have words. All right. copper wires, if you're wondering. Alright, so copper cables, copper cables. Uh, just to keep it at a low voltage going to it at the same time. Uh, you could put, like, I'm, I don't think you could put fiber cable. You could probably put fiber cable, I don't who cares. I'm just using copper because I like it, it's pretty. Um, so, what you want to get is your force field core. Where is it? Force field core. Then you want to get your EU injector. Um, you can have a. I like, I like to use the camouflage upgrade, but that's that's the least important of all the things. And then you need the MFFS area projector. Okay, so these are all the items that you need. So first goes first down goes the injector. 
Then the core on top. Need levers. What? Need levers. We'll get a lever later. Okay. Alright, then you need uh, the area projector on the top. And then um, you can have the camouflage right there. Alright, so as you can see, as, no as you can't see, there's no power going. What? Oh, it's not on, is it? Is it on? Yeah, it's on. It's on. You have to transfer, you have to turn. I have to turn the lever yeah. on. Yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Okay. Levers. Alright, let's get a lever. Oh. Oh no! What it is is I don't have a card. You don't need the lever. That was just oh. a, that was just a weird incident. That All right. Last recording. Yeah, last recording was, 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 kind, of, was kind of strange. Confused. All right, so get your blank MFS frequency card, put it in there, and then uh, it'll it'll lock on. It'll then lock on to that. So now I'm just gonna make this like really fifteen. We don't need to actually. We don't need to cover like a whole. whole covered it in covered it in dirt. Covered in dirt. Yeah. Um. No one's gonna notice that random dirt mountain. All right. So now. This thing is filling up with power. What do you know? Look at that force field. Beautiful. Looks so ugly. I hate that. So what I'm going to do is, I'm going to use my camouflage upgrade, and I'm going to use some glass. And, uh, okay. <laughs> uh, glass is overrated now, so. Yeah. Somebody light a match. Somebody light a match. And it also it'll it'll repair every time you break it, so you can't really do anything with it. Wait, can um, you, wait, wait! If you blow it up, would it keep rebuilding itself? You can't blow it up. It doesn't do, it doesn't touch. It doesn't break. Yeah, it's fake. It's just like it's just an image. Okay. It's not really a. Oh, so that's why I usually use glass because it's um. Yeah, uh, you can see through it, and you can tell where all the enemies are and stuff. Yeah. Um, like a, the zapper force field something. Yeah, there's a zapper force field. I hate using that because I get killed by it myself. <laughs> um, so we're not even, even bothered with that. All right, so. That's where you can you can have like you can have your power directed towards that. You can keep your reactor safe inside this. So actually, just in case it does blow up, you got a force field protecting it. So if if you're in an area like this is a good idea because your force field protect all the explosives. Yeah. Damage. So like if you're living in a hut over here, you're gonna reinforce the cobble. <laughs> reinforce stone. Stone. Okay. Whatever. All right. So now I don't think we've given you a demonstration of the lights yet, so we're um, I'm just gonna I'm gonna just like let it go wild. Um, so let's just. Yeah, you know, I think this happened. This is that like why Chernobyl happened is because these guys are making a bet. See how like high. Bet you can't get it as high as possible. <laughs> All right. Um, so we got a thermometer. Let's see. It's going up like a, a, a bit here. Oh, okay. so... it's going up like 30, 32. So, yeah, so, so here we go. Now you can so see. What's each color? Uh, blue is 100. Light blue is 300. Yellow is 500. Orange is 700, and red nice. is a thousand. Kelvin. And a thousand isn't that much, to Kelvin. be honest. Fourteen thousand is when you want to. Is when you're getting worried. Um, <laughs> when you see it start smoking, uh, you should Lots probably pouring out of it. Yeah, because everything in a. Like, five, I got it. Like, yeah. Everything in like a five block. <laughs> Sorry, that's the howler alarm in the back from earlier. Uh, previous video. Anyways, everything in a five block radius, as I was trying to say, will turn to molten lava when it hits like 10,000 degrees, I think. So, let's try to make it go faster. TNT in there. Look at the door. Okay. Okay. Bam. No! I'm trying to exit out. We're just, okay. Boo, 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 boo. Let's throw those in there. There we go. Alright. Now, let's check the thermometer. All right, so it's it's going up at like 200 a, a second. More. <laughs> more. I don't want to put any more in there. I'm gonna keep it at that. Um, because I absolutely hate this noise. No, no, I'm gonna, I'm gonna leave it. I'm, I'm not gonna break it. I'm not gonna break the machine. Uh, nice view of the sunset as we're preparing. The, okay, so now you can see it's on it's it's on fire. Um, so that means that it's getting like really really hot. Um, so that's fun. And if you don't know, water will absorb the shock. Yeah, it'll it'll absorb it a little bit. Um, but the reinforced stone is is really what is really what's the important the stuff. Hero. Um, because actually this is just gonna it's gonna blow up the water. The reason also here's 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 an interesting fact. The reason we built this um, two blocks higher than the uh, the thing is because of the molten lava situation. So this thing will will continue to fill in even though it turns into molten lava. Um, so. That's why it's 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 an extra block high because um, it's like eleven thousand. See, like it's you can see it dissipating. The water is yeah. like evaporating in parts, but uh, right here it, keeps it just keeps filling in because yeah. it's, it's so high. Um, 
Yes. Aren't we smart? Wow. Well, I am. Yeah, you don't know about this. Alright, we're hitting 14,000, so I'm gonna take a step back. Um, you can see the lava. You can see the, the lava. The, the, the glasses are breaking now. Um, things are on fire. Here we go. Are you ready for this, guys? Here we go! That was much more dangerous than last time, but last time was like still. But look at it. I mean, it's not. Um, it's it's not doing serious damage. If you have a house full of diamonds, you're you're pretty good. So you, look at that. Look at that protection. That beauteous beauty. I had a blast going like that. I think what happened was I forgot to reinstall the reinforced stone here. Okay. And it just kind of it just went for it anyways. I think that's what happened. So don't blame it on don't blame it on design. Blame it on me because I I didn't I didn't refill in the reinforced. There was just dirt under here protecting it. So it's. Oh uh, yeah. That's what happens. Um. So there you go. Thank Isn't you. that beautiful? Um. I don't think this thing works anymore. Oh, it does. Hey, got some extra power still. These things are. <laughs> that that sucks. <laughs> Um, yeah, so here we are in our uh, nuclear reactor. Uh, this is uh, Kyle the Scientist, and we're with Operation Brown Town playing Tech It uh, Minecraft. Uh, like and subscribe, buddies. Bro hammers. Join the cause. For Join the cause. Ah, oh, the, the force field shut off. It's out of power. Because <laughs> the, the MFSU broke too. God. So all the battery power that we stored is just gone. Alright, so um, we'll be seeing you guys later. Up, up, and away! <laughs> Screw this!